What's up you guys, it's Reyna and I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to be making my 2021 vision board and I thought I would make a video and you guys could like make one with me or just like get some inspo or maybe you've never made one and this is like you're trying to figure out what the heck it is. Uh, I cannot explain it that well. I mean, it's literally just like things you want in your life for the upcoming year. I actually have the one I made last year on my wall right now. I'm actually going to be making mine digitally. You can probably see over there on my laptop. Um, just because we're in a pandemic, I didn't really want to go to the store to get like poster boards. And I also don't want to print like a ton of paper, so I thought I'll just make one on my laptop. So... I will link some articles about like vision boards and all that if you want to read more about it. Yeah, let's get started. Lily doesn't like my camera. She's very scared. It's okay. It's okay. It's oh okay. Okay, so the first thing I did, do not judge my apps. <laughs> the first thing I did was I made a Pinterest board called 2021 Vision Board. Um, it's public, so if, I'll link my Pinterest down below if you want to see it. But I'm just gonna like open that to show you guys some of the stuff that I have. So I would definitely start by like finding pictures that you want. I try to do pictures that kind of match the energy and things that I want in my life in this upcoming year. So like we have some cute outfits and fashion and things like that quotes we have like some workout stuff so another thing i did was i made a list of things that i just need and want in my life in 2021 i don't know if i want to say define 2021 but just like things i want and need in my life for the upcoming year and just state i want to be in like no cheers left to cry vibes um so these are the words i've picked out Okay, look at how cute my current home screen on my laptop is. Like, I'm so obsessed with it. I'm kind of sad. I'm going to be changing it right now. So, I'm actually going to open up Pinterest, and I'm going to start by just saving the pictures I want. Um, I might actually take a minute and just, like, add a few more things. But, yeah. So, once you start going, Pinterest makes it so easy and just, like, shows you things that kind of already match the vibe of what you're going for. All right, so another thing I'm actually gonna do really quick right now is, um, so something that I'm gonna put on my vision board is like my um, subscriber goal and then like my Instagram follower goal. Goal. I don't know how that sounds to people. Like I just, I don't know, but I'm gonna do it. So I'm actually gonna take a minute to like edit the followers on my YouTube and Instagram. So we're gonna do that real quick. So I'm gonna use an app called Superimpose. You can use PixArt, but I just feel more comfortable using Superimpose. So that's what I'm gonna use. Um, so I'm gonna try to find someone that has like a follower amount that matches up with the goal or like somewhere I can realistically see myself. I just feel like a little weird talking about follower account. Like that's obviously not what matters at all. Okay, so as you can see, we're just gonna like edit that onto, yeah. So I have that. Alright. So I'm gonna save that and then I'm gonna it'll drop it to my computer. And then I'm also just gonna repeat that process with YouTube. This is a little life hack, but like when you wanna save a pin, you just simply download the image. Cause like for the ever I would simply just screenshot and then crop and be annoyed but you can download so yeah you can do this on mobile as well and it just makes it so much easier and you can use like the it's not gonna be like an awkward crop you know what i mean so yeah Anyways, I have a MacBook Air and I just googled 
I just had to Google like the size of my computer screen, but I have a MacBook Air. So that is what I'm going to be using. So here we go. Okay, now that I have my canvas set up, I'm going to get the little file with the pics that I'm going to be using. And I think I'm going to have them show like this. And then I just have the different ones. And I'm just going to start by dragging them onto the blank canvas and then just positioning them where I want them. So I'm going to load up my vision board into Canva. There she is. I'm going to turn this music off. Mm -hmm. Right, so that I'm going to pull up my vision board words and get them ready to add. And then I'm just going to center this. Um, I would do it more bold, but I'm not going to, just because I want to see and read the pictures in the back, and I actually might do it, like, at the top or bottom, so I'm gonna just add these words really quick, just like that, and then I'll show you guys when it's done. Okay, so I added all my words, um, they're pretty tiny, but I didn't want anything too crazy. And then I ended up moving the 2021 up here, and I layered it. I did, like, the horizon outline in black, and then I did, like, the sage mint, like, filled 2021. And then I did another pink to, like, do this little overlay effect, and so there it is. Okay, and here is my final vision board. I'm so obsessed with it. I love this so much. I think it came out so freaking cute. I literally got a spare camera battery for Christmas, so if one died, I could use the spare to keep filming. Both of them are dead. Anyways, it's 2am, so I'm gonna go to bed right now, but thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Um, comment below what your number one goal is for the new year. Um, I know things are crazy right now, so we'll see how things go. Um, but yeah. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, whatever. Uh, yeah, so thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.